Okay, so we're back again. Another update video on this Buffalo coin purse. As you can see, that's the outline of Buffalo design. Had to get apart just because. Well, actually, somebody was trying to sell my beadwork online, and I didn't really much appreciate it. They're actually trying to sell this beadwork, this coin purse, and claim it as their own. And had to go. I was notified by one of my followers that that was going on so i did a post on my instagram of the person who was trying to sell stuff for me they're trying to sell these and a bunch of my stickers i did which yeah i did restock my inventory and do everything <laughs> i do have more stickers i'm planning on doing but still they're trying to sell this and i had to go put a post up there and kind of not notify people that only i sell my work i'm the only person that does it if you do see something that's kind of iffy, I mean, just ask them for like pictures and stuff. Simple pictures, I mean, like close ups of the work, just to see and verify that things are what they are. I mean, if they say that it's packaged and they can't um, show you the beadwork, obviously that one's probably gonna be a lie because not, much, not many sellers package their work. I mean, they'll put them in jewelry boxes, but they won't package them because. They want to show people off what they have me. Ask for a quarter next to it. Ask for some kind of object next to it. As verification. Don't just take their word as it being it to me. You guys obviously know my work. And obviously you know other people else works. And how it does. So, as always, using size 13 beats. I haven't used 15s on this yet. It's still nice to me. I'm working on the main design. I changed it out from the Buffalo because like I said, they're trying to sell this part. So plus it didn't really work for this. So I went the round design. So it's what I look like a cassette tape again. Once I get the other <laughs> portion in. The infamous cassette tape. I actually do need to make a cassette tape sticker like this, I guess. Or actually make our beat a cassette tape and make it to a medallion, something, something crazy. But I'm working on like new stickers, ideas. This is a big one. I made this one like way too big. So, as you can see, it's huge. <laughs> it's too big. Way too big. I haven't redesigned, but I haven't really worked on it yet. But this is day number six, seven. I think it's seven on this. I hope I can get this side done, get this side worked on too and done. Because then I can just work on the fill section, which doesn't really take me too long. So... In the next three days, I hope to have this part beat it and finish. I do have all the colors I want to pick out. I mean, I still have this dusty rose color here. I want to try to use, but I don't know if it's going to work. Everything's kind of blending and meshing together, but uh, we shall see. So this is kind of a short little update video. Not really doing much. But here it is without the... Kind of hard to kind of hard to do with one hand, with one hand, and how it will look, one-handed, on one side, then the other side. I'm really liking that green. That green really makes it stand out. Plus the cuts in it, the cutting beads. So on here you can see the blue. On my other pictures you can't really see the blue. It looks more black, but that Montana blue with that green, turquoise green. So I'm seeing more of blues and greens of this. Looks nice. Okay, so thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed that. And I'll come back in another few days. Hopefully, I get more progress done, more stuff done. And hopefully, better video. Thank you guys for watching, and hope you guys enjoyed.